this is Anil with a video tutorial for the learning lad on C programming so in this video tutorial we can see the arithmetic operators available in C so in C you can use the arithmetic operators like uh, plus for the addition minus for subtraction star for multiplication slash for division and uh, mod for you know mod operation and uh, plus plus and minus minus for uh, you know increment and decrement so these are the arithmetic operators available in C and now we're gonna see how we can use all these operators in our program. So here for the demonstration purpose we're gonna create three variables it's gonna be int num1, num2 and uh, result. So we're gonna assign this num1 with a value of 20 and this num2 with a value of 10. So first we're gonna see the addition operator that is plus. So we're gonna store the result of num1 plus num2 in the variable result and we're just gonna print it out. So it's gonna be printf and uh, percentage d comma result. So I'm gonna save it, compile it and run it. So as you can see here, it just printed 30. That's because you know, uh, 20 plus 10 equal to 30 so now we're gonna see how we can use this subtraction operator so make it minus save it compile it and run it so it says 10 that's because you know 20 minus 10 is 10 then the multiplication operator for that purpose we need to change this to star then save it then compile and run so as you can see here you know 20 into 10 equal to 200 so then um, the division operator so it's going to be num1 divided by num2 i'm going to save it then uh, compile and run so as you can see 20 by 10 is equal to 2 so now what if our num2 is greater than this num1 so i'm going to make this num2 equal to 100 and uh, save it and compile and run so as you can see here we got zero but we know that 20 by 100 is equal to 0 0.2 but we are getting the value 0 that's because you now we have the variables result num1 and num2 are all of type integer so when you use the data type as integer and if you do any uh, division or any calculation and uh, the result of the calculation is some floating point number then the decimal part of that number will be truncated and uh, the whole number will be returned that's why it prints 0 and the decimal value that is 0.2 is lost. So now we're gonna see about the modulus operator. In C if you want to perform any mod operation then you have to use this percentage symbol. So this percentage symbol is used to represent the mod operation. So here we want to calculate num1 mod num2. That's why we're writing num1 mod num2 and here I'm gonna make this num1 to 10 and num2 to a value 3 so now it's gonna be 10 mod 3 and it's gonna return the remainder of 10 divided by 3 so that is 1 so save it then compile and run so as you can see here it just prints 1 so the last thing I want to teach you is about the increment and decrement operation so in C if you want to increment instead of writing num1 equal to num1 plus 1 you can use the increment operator so to use the increment operator you have to you know you have to use this plus plus so in this tutorial we're gonna increment the value of this num1 variable so that's why we're gonna write num1 then we're gonna write plus plus so now this num1 value will be incremented to some value before that we need to initialize our num1 variable num1 it's gonna be 10 so now after this statement you know this num1 is gonna contain 11 that's because you know this statement is similar to num1 equal to num1 plus 1 so I'm gonna print num1 value so as you can see num1 was initialized to 10 but after this statement or after this incrementation it just printed the value 11 so I'm gonna close it and uh, another thing is if you want to increment this num1 
by 5 then what you can do is you can write num1 plus equal to 5 so this one is similar to num1 equal to num1 plus 5 so I'm gonna save it compile and run so as you can see here uh, because of this statement num1 plus equal to 5 num1 value is incremented by 5 so it just prints 15 so similarly you can use the decrement operator that is minus minus so if you want to decrement the value uh, uh, stored in this num1 variable then you can use num1 minus minus so it, it's just similar to num1 minus 1 so num1 is containing 10 and after this statement it's gonna be 9 so I'm gonna save compile and run so as you can see the value of 9 so if you want to decrement this num1 variable with the uh, a value of 5 let's say you want to you, you want to decrement this num1 by the value of 5 so it's going to be num1 equal to num1 minus 5 so here you can use this num1 minus equal to 5 and it will uh, you know do num1 equal to num1 minus 5 so i'm going to save it compile and run so as you can see here you know num1 was 10 before and after this statement num1 value is 5 so this is it this is about the arithmetic operators available in C and uh, this is how we can use it in our program so thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe see you in the next tutorial